Hi guys, how is everybody doing? It's Empress G TV here. Uh, I haven't done anything for a couple days. Anyway, you know me right now. It's the juice. So this morning I'm going to be doing uh, cucumber, parsley, lime, ginger, and green apple. And then I'm going to follow up with a smoothie. If I have enough time. So, you know, cucumbers loaded with water, so it dehydrates you, and you know, all of that stuff. So, anyway, I'm just going to do this um, right now, and that's juice and a smoothie will be for my breakfast. So, I have everything all cut it up, so I'm not going to, you know, waste a lot of time. So, I'm just going to be ready to juice, so you're going to hear a little noise going. So, I'm doing two large size cucumber because I want enough. To drink throughout the day i drink it throughout the day okay so this should give me uh quite a bit so i do two large size cucumber and a half a bun um i think i use a few um parsley and um a nice generous chunk of garlic of um ginger and basically if you want to do the parsley i do i do it from this end because this is easier to do in the in the juicer you know, and uh, because I don't like to blend uh, my juice because when you blend it, you have to add water. And once you add that water to it, you know, you lose this basically, you know, the consistency of your juice, right? I'm not looking for water. I'm looking for straight juice. So, and the cucumber make a lot of water um, in the blend, in the juicer. So, that's it. Parsley smells very nice. Gotta make a little bit of noise, though. My green juice I'm gonna be using the blender next for my smoothie and that's gonna be using the blender for that and my smoothie is gonna be papaya banana pineapple and some ginger in it uh, lemon mint so I'll just put this out of the way for now This is my green juice here. You know what? I'll pour it when I'm ready because once you, the thing about this juicer, that's why I would love to get me, and I'm gonna be getting me a uh, um, cold press because this juicer, once you use it and you pour your juice in a few minutes, everything come to the top, and um. And you can't keep your juice for too long with this stuff because um it goes brown and this is what you call a configurated um juicer so the one i'm looking for now for my birthday which is friday april 1st um that's on its way i hope i get it from from my what i was told by my family because they're the one who's getting meat um it's on the way from Amazon, so hopefully I get it before or by my birthday. And that juicer, cold press, when you use that juicer, you get all the juice, everything comes out. But in this juicer, what happened is that it eat, it has an eat, eating system in it and it eats up. So you lose some of the nutrient from your juice. And 
it doesn't juice your stuff you lose a lot in it because when i take out this trash sometimes it's so much juice coming out of it so you know what it's it's not the ideal um for juice for for really um serious juicing so right now i'm gonna be doing i have some pineapples and i'm gonna get some frozen bananas And I think some strawberry also. I just grab all my stuff, my banana. Everything is ready to go. But like I said, I'm not doing a long thing. Let me just, okay, here's the strawberries frozen. Let me get my banana. You know what? I'll just use a fresh banana because everything else is frozen. So I have some pineapple here, about a half a pineapple. I might use. Oh, and my mango. Mango is going to be added to it too. So let me grab those. So guys, I have frozen papaya, so I'm not going to bother to use this right now. So I have the mango here, so it's pineapples and mangoes. And I have frozen papaya also, so I just use a frozen one. And a banana, I use a fresh banana. That's papaya. And I'll just use a banana. And I'll put a piece of mint in it and some ginger. And as they say, it's good to go. And that's my smoothies for today. So I'm just going to cut the banana, put it in. The banana is not frozen. I have frozen banana, but everything else in this is frozen so um just gonna do that and i'm just gonna put some yogurt in it to um this the ginger I'm not, i don't want to put too much because the ginger doesn't work very good in the blender in the magic bullet but i'll put a few pieces and i'll have some fresh mint to it so it's good when you get your fruits and you wash them you cut them up you separate them and you freeze them and it's the nicest thing i'm gonna put some a strawberry in also and for smoothies it's best to freeze them you know i don't know if that strawberry is gonna that strawberry is so frozen so i'm just gonna put some mint in it right now and it's good to go I have a feeling that the strawberry is going to be um take for a while so i'm just going to get me some fresh mint the mint is already washed i, I love to use fresh mint okay Put some more light on so what i have in it so far is um pineapples papaya mango and banana and strawberries and i'm gonna put a little bit of yogurt in it so this is the mint and, and a strawberry i'm not sure how the strawberry is gonna um, come out i hope it um blends out i'm gonna add some yogurt to it and this you have for breakfast i'm 
And this morning I have um, um, lemongrass tea. Because we get fresh lemongrass over here to buy, so that is so nice. So I'm just going to add some yogurt. And then we just let it get going. So I do about a cup of yogurt in it. Um, and that I just eyeball because I I'm so good at measuring my stuff, folks. So, so that's I'm just gonna eyeball it. Yeah. I'm gonna put in a little bit of cinnamon also. And that's about uh uh, uh, a teaspoon of cinnamon or the kind of how much cinnamon you love okay and the end will come afterwards and now we're gonna start our blending and hopefully yeah let's mix it up a bit so it's going to take a little bit while I probably have to add a little bit more than the cup of yogurt to it because I'm going to add some honey in the end so this is why it's frozen so it's going to take on does it man pulse it up that does it there we go oh the strawberry is getting there too folks i'm gonna add some more um the rest of the pineapple i was half a pineapple but i was waiting it go down so add the pineapple the rest of the pineapple and pulse it up pulse it up pulse it up then I have all my um, seeds to put in, um, some flax seeds. Um, I am going to be putting in some flax seed and um, pumpkin seeds. So let me just grab my seeds. Okay, I have the flax seeds. And I'm just going to put flax seeds, some flax seeds, some pumpkin seeds. And some... see how it's doing wow so now folks i'm just gonna add in the flax seed mm, it tastes so good folks some flax seed and some about a tablespoon of flax seed and that is also called linseed linseed and chia i'm gonna put in some chia chia i've been so much i've been just as much vitamin and mineral just like any fruits you know so this just you know once you add this to your, your, your smoothie you just, just push it up a notch way up yeah it's so good so i'm also gonna eyeball it i'm gonna put a and this is organic about a tablespoon of chia in and some pumpkin seed and then i had the honey and like I said, folks, anything you have at home, you can use any kind of a fruit. You can also do it, um, it doesn't have to be frozen, but then you have to add, I think, some ice to it because you want it, you know, to get um, the taste. But, you know, but frozen fruits is, is, is better. And I'm also going to have a tablespoon of pumpkin seed. And pumpkin seed is a lot of potassium, a lot of um, magnesium, vitamin and all the good stuff you know and I buy these ones in the um, L food store
you have a glass of this and you don't need no bacon and egg or no fried dumpling or anything this have been enough and it, and the thing about it too it stays in your stomach for a long time during the day you know you have a some bread or um you know toast and egg and bacon and in two foods that leave your stomach you know but this has with all the fiber content in them it stays in your stomach and what you want to have it done that it leaves your stomach very slowly you know and that's a good thing for weight management also for it you know trying to lose weight you know the stuff leave you to leave your stomach very slowly i'm also gonna add a little bit of um lemon lime juice to it and the rest of it is for my green juice um you know that's gonna be, i had it to my green juice so right now everything is there i'm just gonna put in um a tablespoon of honey and if you're diabetic you can keep the honey out you know but i love the taste that the honey gives me so i'm gonna put a tablespoon of um organic honey unpasteurized honey to it because the pasteurized one lose everything it's eaten so everything is gone from it and now for the final re peer resistor is that the word um Yes, one more last blend and then it will be ready. What happened here? Mm. Folks, this is so good. Mm. Wow. All done, folks. This is so good, and this is very nutritious. So I'm just gonna pour the glass, the papaya, and um, the pineapple, the banana, the mango. Wow! Awesome. And my green juice is um, cucumbers, parsley, celery, the green apple. And ginger. Wow. And the thing about um the thing about cucumber it's um it lowers the blood pressure and also good for diabetes. if you have high blood pressure the cucumber and the celery is very good for you to have okay so that's for that and I'm just gonna have this lemon piece of lemon here so this basically is a 
green juice consists of um, cucumber. I use two large cucumber, a cup of stock of celery, parsley, ginger, and green apple. And the smoothies is consists of frozen papaya, frozen mango, um, pineapple, banana, chia seed, pumpkin seed, and flaxseed seed with some cinnamon and um, some unpasteurized organic honey. And this is it right there, folks. That is the juice of the day and the smoothie of the day. Okay, there you go. Can't beat that. And I just put a little piece of mint in the, the smoothie and then I'll just eat it afterward. You know, nothing goes to waste. So folks, um, please like, share and subscribe, okay? And check the notification for new videos and leave me a comment, okay? So guys, have yourself a nice day and I just want to pick up a few people. Flowers, lifestyle in Jamaica. Gullicock and um, all the guys over Richard Brown and Jamie Howard big up yourself and folks go out and subscribe to their channel Those are very good ch Progressive channels that are doing a lot of good for people. Okay, so um, this is Empress GTV saying See you later. Okay. Have a good day. Peace and I'm out